Whoop. Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In this lecture, I'm going to teach you how to make HTML making choices like radio buttons, check boxes, drop down boxes. So you can see the examples over here. So we will create everything these three in this video. So please watch full video and uh, give like. Uh, so let us start it. So we have created this much. Our username, password, and the comment box. So after this, we are going to create three buttons. So let's move on. So I've already created a form tag over here. So I don't know. I don't want to create another one. So inside it, after this text area, I will create my paragraph. So to show, select any genre from below. So it will give an paragraph overview. So after this, my input tag. And then type is equals to radio name would be let's say genre and then my value would be rock and then close this Hello, I, I want to give my default checkbox so let's just give check search done and close it and dis display by proc so it's done so now next input type is equals to radio and then name would be genre value would be let's say jazz and then uh, it will display by name jazz and then again in portal so we have created this much and then i want to give a break a line after my paragraph so let's br tag so it's done let's save this file and see how it looks so here it is here it is my select any genre from low and here is our radio buttons default is rock and then you can choose anyone so let's move move on to check boxes so same like radio buttons we will create check boxes so after my paragraph i will create another paragraph for radio buttons and then remove this closing tag and then type uh, choose or select your box let's see. and then under this let's break a line then input tag so input tag my type would be checkbox so so name would be let's say service And my value would value would be iTunes. And then default would be let's say is checked, already checked. So it's done. And close tag. And then type of display name would be iTunes. So it would be small. Then again input. Let's do the same thing. So I have added this much, and then uh, close the paragraph tag, and then that's it. Let's save it. Go to Google. Let's reload it. So here it is. Over. Select your box, and iTunes is already checked. You can click over here, 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 here. So it will 
allow multiple times so it's the difference between radio box and check box so after this we will create a, a drop down disk box so let's go enter so we are already in the form so after this tag and then create a p tag so let's say what do you want to eat so what's in so my type select tag and then inside select tag here name attribute let's say fruits this my options would be option tag so here is let's give a mango and here in option opening tag my I will give value also value let's say mango and then again repeat the steps so so not input option here value it's apple so I created this three things and then after this close the select tag so it's done so let's remove this thing let's save it now FC R so let's move down so here it is what do you want to eat so here is the box let's click down so here is our three things grapes apple mango the first one is mango because we have created this here our mango so this is how you can create these things so guys if you find this video helpful please give us thumbs up do like share subscribe and uh, do tell me in the comment box how you feel it how you learn it if you find helpful so it's ayana i'm signing off